Here's the sound level meter you'll be using for noise measurements at the laundry. The batteries can be checked simply by turning the instrument on, pressing battery check, and seeing that the needle swings into the region marked battery. To calibrate the instrument, you use a separate device, the sound level calibrator. Turn it on and make sure its battery light appears, indicating that its batteries are OK. Then turn the control knob to the first frequency setting, 2000 Hertz. A raucous tone like this means you have to hold the control knob in the start position a little longer to get the oscillator going. This is how it should sound in the 2000 Hertz position. Now, using the appropriate microphone adapter, mount the calibrator on the sound level meter. For calibration, make sure the meter is set on the C scale and slow response. For each of the five calibrator frequencies, note the meter reading. During the survey, the meter will be set on the A scale, slow response. The A scale is designed to hear on the same curve as the human ear, and OSHA regulations require measurements to be taken on this scale and slow response. In the calibrator instruction manual, there are correction tables that should be used if you have to correct for atmospheric pressure in areas of high altitude. The calibrator itself must be checked for accuracy at least once a year by an authorized lab. The inspection sticker will show you if the instrument is still current. 